Welcome back to Extra, everyone. All right, time to get you all caught up on all the stars making headlines in Hollywood. Here's this weekend's Extra, Extra. Kate Hudson covering her shaved head under a Panama Jack hat. The Marshall star unveiling pieces from her new Fabletics line in honor of Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Breast cancer that affects all of us is something that we should just continue to see progress made and looking like we're getting close. Fabletics partnering with CFDA's fashion targets breast cancer to raise funds for research. CFDA is amazing because we're really sort of fashion brand meets athletic wear and it's kind of this nice collaboration. Inspiration behind it is simple. You know, we took the colors of the fashion targets breast cancer and breast cancer awareness month. So blues and pinks and we just married them. <laughs> He's one of country music's hottest and brightest stars, Thomas Rhett, dropping his third album, Life Changes, and recently nominated for three CMA awards. A couple nominations was incredible, but to get like into the category of male vocalist is just like mind blowing to me. Now he's spreading his brand. Here we are at the Home Team Pop Up Store, so pretty rad. Thomas selling his home team original fashion designs, t shirts, jackets, hats, usually sold during his tour. What home team means is like when I'm in your town, I'm rooting for your team, uh, for your local restaurants. If you missed out in LA, you might find these looks on the second leg of his home team tour. An incredible story against all odds. He's learning how to be alive. Augie, a documentary about the Steve Jobs of the fitness industry, Augie Nieto, who's in a fight for his life after his ALS diagnosis. You actually think there's a chance that you can lick this thing? <laughs> I, I don't think I could get up in the morning if I didn't think so. Augie in select theaters November 3rd. He's the one to watch. Hi, I'm Alex Iono. The 21-year-old finding fame on YouTube with mashup covers of popular songs is quickly going mainstream. When you first started getting that reaction, you saw the numbers starting to rise on YouTube, and you realized you weren't just doing this for yourself, but people were really responding. It was great to hear that people were connecting. Fans really connecting to his original hit, Does It Feel Like Falling? Does it feel like falling, falling, falling? It's been like quite a whirlwind, quite a surreal whirlwind. Next, Alex is headlining his first tour. I'm excited. It's my first headlining tour ever. For tour dates, go to extratv.com.